All right, welcome back to Tampa Bay's Morning Blend. I do say uh, that I have, uh, me and you, Natalie, both the dream jobs, right? We absolutely love our jobs. If I was going to pick anything else, it may be either hosting a game show, uh, yeah. certainly playing along with game shows on TV. Uh, but we get to do that now. We get to incorporate it. This morning we are playing Dumpster or No Dumpster. We want you to play along at home uh, as well with Antiques Appraiser, Dr. Lori. So good to see you. Always good to be with you. You're a gamer too, aren't you? You like you like doing games. And... I'm totally a gamer. I'm competitive. <laughs> I love games. <laughs> Any game. So explain the rules, Dr. Lori, on what we're doing and how people at home can kind of follow yeah. along. Help Dumpster. me out here. Dumpster or no dumpster is really easy. Basically, it's just like you're cleaning out and you come upon an object, one object. Does it go in the dumpster or do you keep it? And anything that goes in the dumpster, for our purposes, is something that, in fact, is worth less than $50. So we just arbitrarily took $50 and I said, that's our number. So again, people say, I wouldn't throw away something for, that's worth $50. Okay, but for the purposes of our game, anything under 50 bucks, <laughs> dumpster okay and oh. you are a frequent guest of our show but for whatever reason if people are just tuning in give us a little background on how you're able to uh, educate us um as often as you do and as good as you do there's really no one like thank dr you. Lori. thank you i am the phd antiques appraiser and i evaluate twenty thousand objects a year at more than 150 events and virtual events too all over the united states i have a phd from penn state and I've been an, an expert appraiser for the last 22 years. Okay. Again, Dr. Lori's been joining us on our Facebook live shows for quite some time, but we're back on air with her. So I want to make sure people know what they're truly getting with Dr. Lori. Thank you. People can okay. always send objects to us through your Facebook page too. Yeah. I uh, like it. Okay. Let's go ahead and start. This is my first time playing here. So Lori, okay. let's begin. Number one, this is a Native American basket. That's it. That's all we get. <laughs> well, do you have a question? <laughs> um, how old? 1880s to 1930s. Ooh. Oh. I was going to chuck it, but now that's uh, the Pacific Northwest. Of tribes of the Pacific Northwest. That's Seattle and the Inside Passage of Alaska and such. You know what, Lori? We've been having some fun with you for quite some time. I don't ever remember you showing us anything from um, the Native American past hey, or, or a tribal past a, before. It's a new game. It's a new yeah. season. It's summer. I don't have anything <laughs> to show baskets are so popular right now. They're certainly all in, you know, I mean, they're, I, I, I can't throw it away. I feel like, I feel like you would need to keep that. Yep. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. So no dumpster, right? No dumpster. It's worth $750. Wow. Wow. Right? Is it because of condition? Is it because of what's, what makes it so valuable? All different aspects make it valuable, but some of the criteria that makes it valuable is the step pattern, which represents, mm -hmm. of course, the native tribe of the Pacific Northwest, as well as the condition, as well as the size. So, okay. Yeah. Right. Nice. I like it. We okay. won. Okay. We did good. Next item. Number two. Ooh. Okay. What is this? She is, is a ceramic. A she is a ceramic, in this particular case, handkerchief holder. She would be seated on a dresser or a bureau. And she dates to about the 1960s. What country? Eight, made in America. She's about eight inches tall. Dumpster. Have you ever seen one? No. I don't think you can throw this away. I say dumpster. I say dumpster. Oh, oh, Natalie's ready to pitch it. I clean out. I know. It's worth I don't know. I feel like. Oh. Yeah, I would keep it. I don't know. <laughs> it's, it's so unique. I've never seen anything like it. Yeah, well, well that's why I'm here to show you what you've never seen. <laughs> okay, so what say you? What say I? 45 bucks. So it's, that's a dumpster, just like Natalie said. <laughs> Good job, Nat. Good job. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah, luck. Beginner's Next luck. One. Okay. Do you what know what this is? That? Is that a scroll? <laughs> like some kind of scroll holder? It's not a scroll. 
it looks like, is it one of those uh, piping bags that I can never remember what they're called from a really long time ago when they used well, wood? Well, not plastic. a piping bag from a really long time ago, but if you pull back that part that looks like a plunger, and maybe a lot of us have been doing this now because of our stay at home orders, we've been doing cleaning. This is a circa turn of the 20th century vacuum cleaner. Oh, so wait a minute. This is a vacuum cleaner? That you would pull it open and then you would literally push the dust. Oh, no. Oh, that's got to be a gag item. No. That's There's really no way that would work. <laughs> you know what? I may clean like that. I may just kind of clean from the side, but I think I can kind of relate to that. That was in the circus, and one of the, no. the clowns were using that no. to try to vacuum. That came into one of my events. Someone actually had that. So, I mean, all of these were true. Turn of the 20th century vacuum cleaner. Is it a dumpster or no dumpster? Does the market want it? Is somebody collecting those? Dumpster or no dumpster? I'm saying dumpster. I'm going to say hold on to it. It's it's cheeky. It's cheeky. It's worth $70. People actually collect it. <laughs> How about that? Natalie, I want you to vacuum your house with that now when you buy it. All you do is like move all the dust around. Yes. <laughs> what I do anyways. I don't, I don't have time really for that. And we're also okay. out of time on our show. Okay. <laughs> so good to see you, Dr. Lori. Uh, beginner's luck, I feel like. Thank okay. you. Okay. 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 So well, awesome. yes, you're going to join us weekly, but people can find you in the meantime on your website. Uh, you're all over YouTube, social media. People can send you in pictures. They can do video conferences. We love you, Dr. Lori. Thank you. I hope this I game better, you. too. I, I did well. well you know, I, I love you, too. Don't forget the YouTube channel channel lots of good information at drlorivee.com awesome all right stay right there we'll be right back